Okay, question nine on the higher paper. If you're doing the foundation paper, this is right towards the end of the paper. This is question 23. Gives us a square and a rectangle. It says the perimeter and the square are the same. And we need to work out the area of this. Well, first of all, let's use the perimeter. And let's find out what's going on. Well, for the square, we know that that's 5x up there, and we know that's 5x on the other side. It's the same as the opposite sides. So I know that the perimeter of the square is equal to 5x, 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 which is 20x. If I look at the rectangle, excuse my writing, I know the bottom has got to be the same as the top, and the right has got to be the same as the left. So to find the perimeter, the distance around the outside of the shape. To find the perimeter of the rectangle, I need to do 2x and 2x, which is 4x. 1 and 1 is 2. And I also need to do 4x and 4x, which is 8x from the top and the bottom. And 5 and 5 is 10. So I know these two things are the same. So I know that 20x, the print of the square, must be the same as, well, these two added together, which is 12x plus 12. I know that. So I can solve this equation now. I can take away. 12 on both sides, 12x on both sides, sorry, and that gives me 8x is 12, then I can divide both sides by 8, gives me x is 12 divided by 8, or x is equal to 6 over 4, 3 over 2. This is actually the decimal 0.5. Not quite finished yet, because I know that my x is worth 1.5. So now I know it. the rectangle, which is 4x plus 5 and 2x plus 1. So I now know my rectangle which was 4x plus 5 and it was 2x plus 1 I now know those dimensions actually this is 1.5 4 1.5 is actually 6 6 plus 5 I really know that's 11 and I know this distance here from top to bottom 2 1.5 is 3 plus that is Four. So to find the area of the rectangle, we have to do four times eleven, which is forty-four centimeters squared. I think you might need to go back and check out how I did this question because it's a little bit long and it's a little bit tricky, but um, you should be able to answer this.